The South Korean ambassador and other Korean nationals have barely managed to escape from Afghanistan. Ambassador Cha Tae-ho shared a story of the desperate escape. The South Korean ambassador to Afghanistan was the last Korean national to escape from Afghanistan. Cha Tae-ho says the situation was so desperate that there was no time to pack his suit. On the morning of August 15th, a report was received that the Taliban had advanced all the way to the area located just 20 minutes from the Korean embassy. Soon afterwards, there was a phone call from the embassy of South Korea's ally. The embassy decided to withdraw from Afghanistan. The staff quickly destroyed important documents and rushed to board a helicopter sent by the ally. When they arrived at the airport, it was utter chaos. While the embassy staff boarded a plane, Ambassador Che and two other embassy officials decided to stay after hearing that one South Korean national living in Afghanistan was still in the country. One day later, all of them finally boarded an American plane and left Kabul. As scores of Afghans swarmed the runway, they had to wait at the airport for more than 12 hours in fear and anxiety. The ambassador is now in Qatar. As he had to rush to make the dangerous journey, he didn't even have time to speak to his loved ones on the phone yet.